out there, Fernando. Now you can't tell by looking at him or any of the other parrots we have out here right now is whether or not they're males or females. Quite often in the parrot family, males and females look exactly the same to us. The reason we know he's a male is we've taken a drop of blood, sent it away to a lab, and they can actually tell us that through his DNA. Now the reason why we didn't know, I'm not too sure, because he's always been a little bit of a flirt with the female Amazons in our collection. Fernando, what happens when you see one of the girls? There we go. A little bit of a comedian getting a chuckle out of himself flirting with the ladies. Now by nature, parrots are very playful though, and Fernando is certainly no exception to any rule. This is his favorite game to play with his trainers. <laughs> Loves a good tickle. Now we do like to call him our master of sound effects. He's picked up a few living with us. First off, the sound we make when we drink a cold glass of water. Some good little chuckle outs. He has learned to snort like a pig. <laughs> a little rude, isn't he there? Well, we're not done yet. He has learned to bark like a dog. <coughs> not a very intimidating dog, but a bark nonetheless. Now he's obviously very talented though, and his talents actually extend musically, loves whistling, singing, and dancing. So we're going to warm him up with some dancing today. Shall we dance? All warmed up, ready to whistle. Keep in mind as he whistles for you, it is different each and every presentation. He makes these tunes up as he goes along, so I never quite know what's going to come out of that little beak, but I'll see what he has for you all today. Happy to see you applaud for his whistling. Unfortunately, his abilities to sing are a little bit limited to the fact that he has been learning to sing his favorite song from us. So we're going to ask everybody, use your imagination, and we hope you might recognize this favorite tune of his. Pretty bad, but I think if he clears himself up, we might be able to get this. A few good coughs, a bit of a treat. Let's see if we're back on track now. Oh. 
sound a bit like O Canada. All right, let's try that again. Very patriotic. He's done a great job for us today. Let's hear for Fernando. Well, here at African Lions Fair, we do believe that the first steps in conservation are education. So we hope you haven't just enjoyed meeting our birds. Their wild numbers are currently ranging in a couple of hundred individuals. Put it into a bit of perspective, there's more of you sitting in our audience today than there are of her wild counterparts. So we want to invite you all to come on down, meet her, ask any questions about her or any of the